been on the camera like this in a minute. Been a little minute, been minute. Been a little minute. Been a little minute. Been a little minute. Been a little minute. Y'all, it's been a little minute since we stood up. Y'all ain't seen us in a minute. Hey, we've been sitting down to eat. We've been, been sitting down to eat. That's why we gotta work out. Hey, we gotta work out. Hey, we gotta work out. Hey, Okay, let's get serious, because I'm already getting out of breath, and that's not good. Yeah. Listen, we got to get in shape, okay? Let, let the wind hit. <sighs> smell chicken, though. I smell chicken. You don't need nothing else. No, <laughs> get food off your mind and get your mind in the zone, okay? All right, all right. What's, What's good, good loyal gang? So we're making this day, y'all, with another video. As y'all can see, we hype right now, y'all. It's been a minute since we came on here and just talked to y'all. Y'all hey. ain't seen us stand up in a minute. It's been a, it's been a little minute, minute. Down. Been a little minute. Been a little minute. Been a little minute. So, y'all, what we're going to be doing today is we've been getting a lot of comments. We've been trying to let the comments slide. Don't let them slide. We've been trying to let them slide. But a lot of people been saying, like, why y'all don't eat healthy? Yeah, why are you eating all that stuff? Why y'all eat so much cheese? Why are you feeding Lily eat all that bad stuff? Yes. So, y'all, we are going to be showing y'all exactly what we do every single day. A lot of y'all always ask us how y'all eat all that food. Mostly him, because I don't really eat that yeah, much. Yeah, I mostly eat all the food. He, he be going in. Y'all be getting them triple cheese burgers up. We know. Hey, hey. We know with the whole bowl of cheese. We know. <laughs> if y'all follow me on Instagram, y'all already know we live in our backyard. This is literally what we do all day when we're not working. But um, what we're going to be showing today, y'all, is kind of like a behind the scenes of what we do outside of the mukbangs y'all know we just started doing the mukbangs and the eating videos and stuff yeah. so we have to make sure we can you know stay in shape and stuff like that i done took like five days off brian been more consistent yeah. than me but i'm gonna tell y'all right now i do have a separation in my abs from having all my kids so that's why i don't really work out too too much because i don't want to make anything worse so i am going to be showing y'all exactly how i do my little lightweight would you say like lightweight yeah, it's like well, a little light it's not it's not heavy yeah it's not like heavy it's not heavy it's just kind of light it's just light yeah yeah i mostly like focus on legs and stuff like that because i can't really do too many strenuous um workouts and stuff because i do have the diastasis erectile which is the separation of my abs but what really helps me y'all is my shapewear so i got this waist trainer plus four other waist trainers that i'm gonna be showing y'all throughout this video that help me work out it helps keep my my core strong so this is one of the waist trainers right here that i have from that i got from femi y'all shout out to them because listen ever since i started using these i've noticed that my posture has definitely been it's, it's been on point mm -hmm. like i'm gonna show y'all exactly how it looks with how i look without the waist trainer y'all know i had to have four kids now so i i'm so mad that i started waist training really late but i'm gonna show y'all the different styles that i got and the different uses of, of all of them and stuff like that but we're gonna go ahead and get into this workout routine for the sun come back out oh yeah because it's, it because it's hot <laughs> <laughs> let me go ahead and turn my music on waiting on him okay he got his music so let me go ahead and turn my music on so y'all so i can get in the zone All right, y'all, so I'm getting ready to change into my next waist trainer. So, so I like this one because I could just zip it up and it's super comfortable. As y'all can see, and then I like that it has the backup adhesive. Y'all see that? And like I said, this just really helps my core when I'm doing certain exercises. So I really like this one because it really gives me that back support. Really like that one. As y'all can see, it makes sure you get my poopa in there and everything, y'all, and I'm good, good to go.
see what we eat after we get done doing our workout so before we do that because i do wear a race trainer around the house and i did want to show y'all the different styles that Femi carries so this is another style this one right here is gonna snatch you okay it has like these these little claps on the side claps am i saying that right claps <laughs> claps is that right snaps or claps it has these on the side and then you just bring it together as y'all can see with me having the separation the um my abs being separated it's really hard for me to wear stuff like this and this is just me being real with y'all i'm gonna keep it completely raw with y'all as y'all can see it's really hard for me to get this on and usually stuff like this i try to stay away from because only because I know that I have the my stomach does protrude. My sister actually wears this one and she loves the support that it gives, but she doesn't have the ab separation. So as y'all can see, if I try to close this up, I ain't gonna be able to breathe. This is the next one, y'all, that I can't, I cannot fit, unfortunately. And it's all because of, like I said, my belly does protrude. This one right here, it comes with it comes with the support at the top instead of it being like a like a strapless one. It has straps on it. So it really gives that extra support. Y'all, when I tell y'all this thing right here works so good, this is another one that my sister uses and she loves it. And it comes once again with the zipper. When I tell y'all this thing is top quality, y'all see that? This thing gonna snatch you in. All right, y'all, so this is one of three that I can actually use. This is the one that I mostly use around the house. Like I said, when we're getting ready to do a mukbang, I just slip this thing on, keep everything nice and tight. This one I like to wear around the house simply because it gives me really good posture control. I feel like my posture, I'm not all hunched over, but I really love the support that I get with this one. Now, this one does have the claps on it, but um, it does give me a little bit more space and like space to be able to work with. And it's a little bit more stretch, more stretchable. y'all okay so this one right here it gives me the most support y'all as y'all can see the loose skin the full foot everything it sucks everything in y'all now the only thing i have not tried is to try to wear this underneath my clothes simply because i don't think it'll be comfortable against my skin this one i don't really prefer to work out in but i do like to wear this one when i'm just doing stuff around the house and i'm cleaning when i'm working when i'm sitting at my desk because as y'all can see it gives me really really good support but i definitely have seen some improvement as far as my posture as far as my um my ab support and my core support that's the main thing because i feel like i have a really really weak core i really love the material of this one right here so like i said this is the one that i wear around the house and then the ones that y'all saw me working out in all three are my favorite waist trainers from feed me shapewear so make sure y'all check them out i'm telling y'all they have some really top quality shapewear waist trainers all of that good stuff so y'all make sure y'all try them out i'll leave everything in the description box below if i have a coupon code i'll leave that in the description box below as well if y'all have ever done waist training before give me some tips in the comments if you have the separated abs or loose skin or if you have multiple kids give me some um tips in the some tips in the comments below and make sure y'all go over there and pick up y'all a waist trainer because listen these waist trainers are not ones to be played with y'all they did what needed to be done because the quality of these waist trainers is a one as y'all can see uh-huh we ain't got the spread today, y'all. We got a little something healthy, healthy. We got a little something healthy. Lily ain't feeling this, y'all. She like, what is this green stuff? I don't think she ever had salad before. No, she never had salad before. She never had salad. Y'all, she done tried to take my little tomato off my plate real quick. That's why she looking like that, because she trying to get it. <laughs> she trying to get it before we notice. <laughs> you can't eat that tomato like that, and you ain't going to like it. You're going to spit it right out. Right. <laughs> so as y'all saw at the beginning, we took y'all through our process, our fitness. Well, what should I call it? Like our workout routine? It was routine. like a little workout routine, a little yeah. mini workout routine. Kind of what we eat right here on like our, during our lunch time. Salad is from Chick-fil-A. This is their cob salad. So that's mostly like what we'll have for lunch. Sometimes we'll have a salad, or we'll have, um, this is what Lily got y'all. She got some tomato soup. Sometimes we'll have tomato soup and grilled cheese, or we'll do like tuna and crackers or something. Y'all see her? I can't even. I can't even talk. Huh? I can't even talk. <laughs> now why you made that face? <laughs> so she's eating some organic. Um, what's it? I think it's called Pacific. I'll make sure I put it in the, on the video the brand that she's eating. A specific a, um, uh, Pacific tomato soup. It's Pacifico, I think. Pacifico. You don't know what it is. He don't know, y'all. I'm the one to be buying the organic stuff, y'all. So, we've been getting a lot of comments and asking, like, why we, why we don't eat anything healthy. 
why we only eat junk food, why we eat so much cheese. So that's what we're going to be talking about today, y'all, while we eat our food. Um, so like I said, this is after, this is our post-workout meal. So we usually do something like, we, we make sure we have a vegetable. Um, sometimes we'll do an egg, cheese, and spinach wrap. Or we'll do like a tuna and spinach wrap. Um, or we'll do like salmon patties. We've been eating a lot of different stuff, y'all. But some, like days like this, we really don't have time since we have to record. We really didn't have time to make nothing. So we just went to Chick-fil-A and got a salad. Now, I don't want to hear nothing about no ranch. <laughs> Yeah, I don't want to hear nothing about no ranch. I don't want to hear nothing about no ranch, because listen, I can't eat no dry greens. <laughs> yeah, I can't. Uh, it, it's got to go down. It's got to yeah. go down somehow. Yeah, we're going we gonna to keep it realistic with y'all. We eat. We try to eat healthy. We try to incorporate greens as well. But we like to eat. Like, we like to eat a lot of different yeah. stuff. Um, We like our fried food, but we, don't, we only eat fried food, of, like, maybe what? One time, one or twice, once or twice a week? Yeah. Probably about once or twice. I mostly make baked chicken and baked fish. That's what we mostly eat throughout the week. And then, like, if we eating out, we'll get, like, some wings or some uh fried... Let me go ahead and eat because I'm hungry. <laughs> or we'll get, like, some fried uh, chicken, fried chicken from somewhere. So, yeah. So, this is what it's looking like, y'all. Very much so healthy. And we don't put a lot of ranch on there, so... Yeah, we just do a little bit. Like, it's a, like a dry. light ranch. Yeah, it's yeah, a light ranch. Light ranch, yeah. You see it. It's, mm -hmm. it's the coat the, the lettuce so it yeah. ain't dry. So that way it have a little taste to it, a little flavor. All right, Lily. Hmm. You ain't got to do all that. A lot of y'all be asking, like, how come we don't feed her any, like, healthy foods and stuff? But y'all have to realize that we, on, we only eat like that on the mukbangs. And most of the time, A lady don't eat the food. Mm -mm. It look like she's eating it, but you know, she might take two or three bites, and after mm -hmm. that, she's playing it. Yeah, as y'all can see, she be throwing the food half the time. So, yep. the only person that's really eating is me. Yep. So. Oh, man. You make a mess. Y'all see you staring at me like you're telling me. You know what I'm saying? Hmm. Let's see how she about to eat them. Her first piece of salad, y'all. I don't know, she. You can't just put the whole thing in your mouth. I told you oh, yeah. Don't put it back on my plate. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what you like to do. I do wish that she ate more of her food. Wouldn't you say that? Yeah. Cause she kind of plays around in her food a lot, so that's why we try to give her a lot more healthy snacks. <clears throat> she um, snacks more than. Yeah, she snacks more than she eats, like, regular food, I feel like. You feel like that, too? Yeah. I like some spaghetti or something. Oh, yeah. But even still, I feel like she take a few bites of stuff. Then it don't have to be chopped up. Mm. But even I like that kinda, lasagna, though. I almost kind of like blind, uh, blended. The lasagna wasn't blended. Oh. Well, yeah, maybe that's what it is. Sometimes she just, like, I don't know, maybe she's just, like, really sensitive to textures. Because it's like certain textures, like even bananas, y'all. Unless it's mixed inside of something, she will not eat it. I don't know if it's like a texture thing for her. Because as soon as it hit her tongue, she spit it out. <laughs> Literally. She don't even give it no time to marinate. None, none of that. Well, there's too much food in my mouth. Mm-mm. I only put a little bit on spoon. But I know that's another thing. When it's too much on spoon, she don't eat it. Oh, my mouth's so small. Yeah. Her mouth is really small. But yeah, so we just want to address that. We um, like I know a lot of people were saying with her on that cereal video, her eating cereal. That was her first time eating cereal, literally her first. And we don't even eat cereal. The kids don't even eat cereal unless they go to their grandparents' house. And they don't then, give her like four bites. Well, yeah, but people are still saying don't give her like sugary cereal. But maybe they thought that's what she eat on the regular. But she eats plain oatmeal. The yeah, only there were like two cereals on it. It was like. When well, no, they. I'm just saying, they probably thought that she eat that, like, on the regular. Uh, you want this tomato? I'm going to see what she do with this tomato, y'all. Because she trying to get it. You can't eat. Uh, I got to cut it up. Hold on, I got to cut it. You can't eat that whole tomato like that. It's all slippery. You ain't going to like it. You're going to spit it right out. Watch watch what she do, y'all. What was that? She thinking about it. The only thing about 
I say the only downfall, uh, eating like this, you know, eating salad like this, mm-hmm. you be hungry. Yeah. You be hungry like maybe 20 minutes later. Especially me. Mm. Since I've been doing these mukbangs, I didn't expand, my stomach didn't expand it. Yeah. So I can eat more than I usually eat, you know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like almost like I'm gluttoning, but I don't even be full. I just still be eating. You yeah, like, I think once he started doing the mukbangs, he really realized, like, how much food he can really put down, like, and tell him about, like, kind of how you feel like you gain weight. Oh, yeah. So, it might not seem that to y'all, y'all might see, make it seem like, y'all might think I'm, like, slim, but to me, when I look in the mirror, it seemed like I started to get wide, I started to get love handles and stuff, and I'm not used to that, so, mm-hmm. I was like, yeah, I don't, I don't want that dad bod, that's what I want. I don't yeah. want that. So you still want to be like slim and stuff. Yeah, like I that. still want to not even slim. I just don't want to be cut, cut yeah. and ripped like mm-hmm. I usually be. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I know I put on a, I feel like I put on some a couple pounds. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? So I'm gonna kind of just like trim that fat up and then you know rip it up and stuff like that. So cause you was, you weren't working out like you used to. Yeah, so I was eating that and then mm-hmm. I go lay down. Especially once we first started them up, things, y'all, he wasn't really working out at all. No, that's because I had that itis. Yeah. I started eating all that food, and I was mm-hmm. just, like, instantly tired. Yep. And I noticed, like, with me, y'all know I can't really work out too much because I have a, um, because my abs are separated, I can't really do too much. That's why y'all saw in the little workout routine, I get winded really quick. And it's not, yeah, I am out of shape. I ain't gonna act like I'm not. I'm out of shape, but also, too, you got hair all in your mouth. Oh, maybe she do like the tomatoes. She eating it. She ain't spit it out. Yeah, baby, do you anything? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> baby, like, it's like, something, like something wrong with the tomato. No, I'm just saying, baby, do you anything? They ain't really got no taste bud. Oh, she liked it. Is that yummy? Thumbs up. So she liked the tomato, y'all. So I'm going to start getting these grape tomatoes. I think these are grape tomatoes or cherry tomatoes. What are they called? Grape tomatoes? You don't even know. I don't even know. That's how you know you're unhealthy. <laughs> you don't even know what the tomato called. I eat that tomato soup, but. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, I'm still trying to get Brian to eat like more vegetables and stuff. I remember I seeing a couple comments like this. It was like saying, um, mm-hmm. like, how uh, I can eat so much and then don't put on, you know, mm-hmm. a lot of weight. A lot of weight, yeah. It's because I got a high metabolism. That's what it is. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But I can tell that it's starting to slow down. <laughs> That thing is starting to slow down a little bit. It's starting to slow bit. down. <laughs> so, you know what I'm saying? I, I don't know. It's just for me. I know that my shape is kind of changing a little bit. Mm-hmm. Uh, far as in, like, you know, my stomach area. Like, hmm. <clears throat> then again, I could have just been full already. So, mm-hmm. I don't know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. All I, I know just, is I'm, I'm going to keep continuing to work out. He don't like to eat a lot of fruit, y'all. That's one thing. No, he, I eat some oranges. I eat the basic fruit, which is the oranges, strawberries, um, grapes. Um, He'll eat that if that's the only thing you know. No, I, I, no, I On eat the regular smell, you're not going to eat it. No, I'm not going to eat it. I eat it. Nah. Um, what else you don't it? eat it on the regular. I, now I won't eat like cherries or some stuff like that. That's the, that's the thing, though. Cherries is good. I don't know, it just don't, when I bite into it, just, I, it's a texture thing for me. No, I don't texture thing. I don't know. It's like you getting older. Mm. Forget the texture. You ain't even eating for texture no more. Right, but that's why I eat all my greens. Mm. I eat all my green food. We just wanted to speak on that because we see a lot of comments, a lot of people saying like, oh, uh, diabetes, all this stuff. The thing is, I feel like it's all about balance. Yeah. And I feel like, live your life, like, Life is eat. short. I want to be able to eat what I want to eat. We don't eat any pork. We don't eat any beef. I don't eat fried food. Um, the only time we eat any beef or pork is on the video. Yeah, the only time. Yeah, that's the only time. You eat. When we had the cheeseburgers. Yeah, that's the only time mm-hmm. I actually eat uh, pork. Look at this girl. Like she all in my. She just want to. If you want to play in it, then just say that, Lily. You taking my food as a joke. I don't appreciate that. But yeah, y'all. So, but on the regular day, we got some quinoa. That's one thing we've been doing a lot of different substitutions, especially with Lily, because she has to have more protein and calories. So we've been doing like instead of regular pasta, we've been doing um, 
lentil pasta instead of regular rice. We've been doing chickpea rice. It's a struggle, y'all. <laughs> it's a struggle. So I be having him eating all types of different things, y'all. Because with me, with me cooking, see, it's different if you cooking. But when I'm cooking, I'm trying to make sure we're getting as many vegetables as possible. Especially if we're going to be doing mukbangs. Sometimes we're going to have ice cream on the videos and stuff like that. I feel like it's all about balance. As long as we balancing everything, guys. As long as we um going outside like the kids, they go outside every single day. Um, getting that vitamin D, you know, just all of that. We make sure that their snacks are organic. Um, they they not have, they don't have too much sugar. Make sure they have fruit, water, all of that stuff. So, you know, and we ain't trying to prove nothing, y'all. We ain't trying to say that we the more we the healthiest and all of that stuff because we not. We like the snack. I know me, I like to eat sweets. So I mean, but, I eat dog all through the night, so I ain't gonna act like I'm yeah the healthiest. Either. Yeah. But just know that we're not eating like y'all see on the video. We're not eating like that every single day. So I feel like, as long as it's, we're balancing it out with some good stuff, Leah, you just, you, you just, yeah. What are you doing to the plate? What are you doing? You're not even eating it. Y'all see this girl? Oh my good. As long as she ain't put it in her hair, I'm good. As soon as you Let me, right. <laughs> I'm glad she can't understand what I'm saying. Well, she can understand. <laughs> she said, what was that? <laughs> you want your mouth wiped off? She just got to just sit on her mouth. So, shout out once again to Femi Shapewear for sponsoring this video. Make sure y'all go shop with them. I will have everything in the description box below. If y'all want to see any type of other routines and stuff like that. I know a lot of people said they wanted to see the nighttime routine and Lily routine and all of that stuff. Mm -hmm. Y'all let us know in the comments. Give us some more video ideas and stuff like that. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Y'all don't talk too bad about me and my workout routine. I was, I be struggling a little bit, you know? Yeah. I kept stopping. <laughs> all right, y'all, we'll see y'all in our next video. We love you guys. Peace, loyal, gang. Gang, 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 gang. 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 Say bye, Lily. Gang. Gang. Say bye-bye.